Somewhere over the rainbow, over the rainbow, where blue birds fly. That's about dreams. It's not that I don't dream, but I have more practical dreams. Over the rainbow, that's about something that's too ethereal for me. I'd just rather get to the end of the rainbow and get my pot of gold. I need some gold. Although I'd settle for a second COVID relief package. That's what I could really deal with. A second COVID release well relief if I got the relief I'd have a little release Mitch Mitch McConnell Trumpety Trump Mr. Orange you know you lost Everybody knows you lost, but you like to lie. Half the time we wonder if you even know that you're lying, but you do. You know you're lying. People who lie know they lie. They might convince themselves of the lie after they tell it, but in the telling, they know it's a lie. You told us to inject bleach. Then you said you didn't, even though it's on camera. I guess that's okay, because we know better. Everybody knows better. You said it. We watched you in real time say it. But it doesn't matter to you, it doesn't matter to Mitch. Doesn't matter to all you elephants. That's the problem right now. There's an elephant in the room. He's got a long trunk. His trunk is like Pinocchio's nose. When Pinocchio tells a lie, his trunk grows longer. When you and your people misbehave, call it the GOP, the elephants, your trunk gets longer. And we hear that bull elephant call from the distance, entering our reality, shattering our peaceful moments. time when so many salivate, salivate because they're hungry, but when so many celebrate the nativity, the birth of the child that means so much to all those people in the GOP, because that's what it's about, isn't it? That's what you say it's about, all you elephants in the room. It's a very strange way, I'd say, for Christians to act. No relief. People dying every day. Not so many had to die, but they're dying. People's out of work, people hungry, 
businesses are failing, and you, Mitch, and the orange guy, and Mnuchin, and all those guys, you just kind of saying, it's all right, it's okay. We don't want to expand the budget. Americans will do just fine. They're resourceful people. Government doesn't mean anything. And then you go to church on Sunday or wherever you go on Sunday. I kind of think a lot of you haven't been in a church for decades. Even if your body was there, was your mind there? Was your heart there? No, you just elephants in the room, bull elephants, giving a battle cry against what's supposed to be your people. What you're really afraid of is what a lot of real elephants are afraid of. Being an endangered species. Because you are endangered. You know it. We know it. So what have you resorted to? You've given up on democracy. You've embraced minority rule. Because that's the only way you can have any power. Because you're in the minority. And that minority is going to get smaller and smaller and smaller. You don't like that. I understand. Because I've been a minority all my life. Things are hard when you're a minority. You're starting to find out. Yeah. Because you're an elephant in the room.
Mm-hmm. 